Hi, we're Stan and Rhonda from Over the Hill Adventures. And today is a very big day for us. Yes, what day is it, Rhonda? Well, today actually is April 4th. Yeah, it's, and a it's April 4th. So. We're coming to you guys real time. Um, we're taking a little break from our, our adventure at the Albuquerque Balloon Fiesta. And we are going to share with you guys what we've been up to. So for the last three years, we have taken you three and a half years and 33,000 miles on every single adventure that we have been on. In our grand design, imagine 2,500 RL. You know we've been talking about this for a while. If you know us and you've watched our stuff, we've been looking at trailers, you know, we, we kind of dream. I don't know, let us know if you guys do that. But this dream has become a reality. Well, not quite yet, almost there. But we, um, we sold Maggie. Okay, today we're gonna clear out the trailer. Um, we're home. <laughs> we did our last trip to Quartzsite and I'm just a little bit emotional, but I'm excited um, to get our new trailer, a new fifth wheel, a new adventure. Um, we've had some amazing memories in this trailer. We're going to make many more amazing memories. So, uh, sold it to a good friend, a gal I used to work with, and just to see her excitement and to hear her excitement really just, um, you know, softens my heart and it makes, makes this process a lot easier. Uh, so, I don't know, let me know in the comments, do you guys get attached to things? I don't think it's the, the thing so much as it is the memories, but we're taking them with us and we have video to remember all those things. And I would encourage you guys, even if you're not gonna start a YouTube channel, uh, maybe I would encourage you not to start a YouTube channel. It's a lot of work, but um, just to video, get yourself a little GoPro and and document these memories that you're making. Cause it's, it's uh, it's been life-changing for us. You know, we are able to share with family. Of course, we've created community with you guys and we appreciate that so much. It's just been life-changing, like I said. You know, you could throw things on YouTube and just leave it private. You can share with family and friends that way. But anyhow, I got work to do. Um, Stan took off our over the hill adventures. It's coming off and it's a little bit of residue still here, you know, but um, gotta get ourselves a new one. But wow, honestly, what an amazing trailer this has been. We are waiting for Carol and Pat to come pick up the trailer. It's very bittersweet, very bittersweet. It's official. We are no longer owners of our Imagine 2500 RL. We've just passed the keys off to Carol and Pat, and they are brand new grand design owners, and they are over the moon. All right. Safe travels, you guys. <laughs> Looks good. <laughs> yeah, watch that tail swing. Is he all right? Oh gosh, I can't, I can't watch. There they go. A lot of hard to tell that. <laughs> we are on our way right now to pick up our new rig. And we want to bring you guys along with us. Yes, um, for the first look, because we haven't even haven't seen it yet. It. I guess this is a pattern. We didn't see yeah, the 2500 RL. We didn't either. see it the last time. So we are seeing it for the first time 
and you will be seeing it at the same time that we see it. Right. There's a couple factors that came into play. We didn't know if this size rig would fit into our side yard where we, you know, prep our trailer, where we get ready to go on our, our trips. If you're joining us for the first time, we are not full-time RV by choice. We have a home base, Lake Havasu City, Arizona, and we travel most of the time. I call ourselves more timers. Well, I, I agree because I want more time on the road. <laughs> and that's why, hence, we got the bigger rig. We got the bigger rig. So with bigger, we knew it would fit because our good friend Scott Thompson, he came on his way to the Quartzsite uh, RV show, and we got his, his uh, what is it, a reflection? He's got a, yeah, he's got a reflection 337 RLS. And yes. We got that on the side yard. So that's bigger, longer. Ours is going to be a wide body. So we're hoping it's going to fit through our, our gate just fine. We can navigate our driveway. Um. We are so excited about this new adventure. So come with us Yeah. as we embark on this new journey. And who knows, we're going to want to go more places, new places, and discover old places too with this new rig. We're ready to go for season seven. We've already got trips booked, so, so we're ready to go. All right, let's go pick up. Another factor that aided in our decision here to get this trailer, I mean, honestly, everything just worked out so smoothly. And the sale of our trailer to our friends, the fact that we're buying this in our hometown at JR Motors. And they probably have been selling Grand Design for about four months, since maybe January. We're not really sure, but when our friend Scott came to town, he's like, hey, I noticed they're selling. This was January, so we bopped down there and then we met our sales gal, Christy. And she's just been great. She's been in touch with us. We. Well, let's tell the story. So we told her we really like this particular model that you're gonna see. And she called us, I don't even know if it was a week later and says, hey, there's one coming off the line in a week, two weeks at that point. And if you guys are interested, put a little deposit down, you'll get first right to buy it if it, when it gets here. So it's here. Well, and, and not only that, this model, has just been coming out. So there's very, very few ownerships, believe it or right. not, for this model. But anyway, uh, we don't want to give away too much. Right. But that's where our journey began. JR Motors has been in Havasu for years and years and years. And they just opened up this new building. They have a huge, huge operation out there now that sells all brands. They've got a service center. They've got mm -hmm. a parts center. And it is just top notch it's incredible so stan's been working tirelessly to get this truck ready well, the hit we're gonna give you is that yeah we'll give that away <laughs> we'll give the hit we're gonna give you is we went with a fifth wheel we are getting a fifth wheel brand new territory for us yes and it is a grand design of course fifth wheel right so this is brand new i always said bigger rig bigger problems and uh well, I'm now, now I feel like I'm going to eat my words. <laughs> it's a little bit of a bumpy ride because why, babe? Man, I've converted this truck into a uh, fifth wheel puller. So I've got the B&W turnover ball hitch back there. I have the Anderson Ultimate Connection fifth wheel connector. And I have the Airlift 7500 XLT airbags and so we're we're ready man yeah. we're, we're ready we put a new wiring harness in there so we could plug right into the yeah. back back of the truck well the nice thing is that we videoed all of the preparations individually what what Stan did and uh, that way if you guys are ever planning on making this big decision and moving from a bumper pull to a fifth wheel and you have the truck to do it and you just need to make the changes then you can do that too yeah and my truck did not come with a puck system uh, i i wasn't even thinking fifth wheel back 
back then when we bought our truck and we brought you with us when we did buy this truck so we're kind of doing the same thing we're bringing you with us and you guys we're going to show you the dealership and everything it's going to be awesome Chris, nice, nice to meet you. Chris, how are you? I'm Stan. Nice good, to meet good, you. Good, good, good. We'll get you all handled. That'd be great. Thank you yeah, so much. Yeah. Thank, yeah. You. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. We could buy a new boat while we're at it. <laughs> wow. Guys, Travis from Service will be leaving shortly. Thank He'll take you, you back for your walkthrough. Thank you. Nice Thank to meet you, you guys. Rhonda. How are you? Rhonda? Yeah, yeah. So you're yeah. going to be doing our little walking? No, I'm not going to be doing oh, the walking. I got, no, okay. I got one of the salespeople here on the floor. Oh, cool. uh, Christy's just on a phone conference with a customer yeah, no right now. So. Oh, no worries. But no Travis worries. from Service is going to be up shortly, and we'll get Fun. you set for your Hi. amazing walkthrough. So We're so appreciative that you guys well, be it's going to be our first JR look family. that we've ever yeah. seen anything. How long, so. well, well, we could ask Christy too, but how long have you guys been selling Grand Design? Um, we've been selling Grand Designs just since the first of the year. That's what we thought. And we've been All through right, three right shipments January. already. Guys, this oh. is Travis from Hi, Service. Travis. He's take you Travis, how are you? I'm Stan, nice Stan? to meet you. You don't mind being on camera, do you? No, I'm right. <laughs> Stan and Rhonda. 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 Yeah, Perfect. that's all right. Okay. We'll, we'll um, quiz you later. I understand you guys have had RVs, so this is yeah. the first thing. No, thing no, for you. not not at all. So this new, is new for fifth wheel. Yeah, right? new for but fifth wheel, and actually, this is the first time that we have ever even seen this rig. So yeah, let's go yeah, for we a walk. See it. Let's go for a walk. Yeah, I love it. Oh, we're gonna go see it. Wow, you guys got a nice parts department. Came out real nice. Wow, wow. Everything you want right here. Oh, they've got everything here. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my wow. gosh. Zero three RL influence and it's Grand Designs brand new line but our understanding is it's rebranding the Solitude S class so no, Solitude S class is no more for 24 Ooh, it rhymes and now the uh, influence is taking a spot so it's kind of the middle ground but um, I want to go inside I don't I don't want to oh we got it we got we got uh, Chris 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 Chris, how are you? I'm nice to meet you. Stan, nice to meet Stan you. And Rhonda. Hi. Rhonda, Chris, nice to meet you. Rhonda. Nice to meet you. you don't yeah. mind us running the camera, do you? Oh, yeah. Chris yeah. is going to show us this wind is pretty bad. Oh, yeah, it so is. So, Chris rough. is going to show us the uh, rig, yeah? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Come inside or out? Oh. Come on in. Let's go in. There you go. It's, it's a little windy out here. Part. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> 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 oh, my gosh. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, oh my gosh. Look at this. Oh, my gosh. I love it. Oh, oh my gosh. This wow. Is, this is better than I expected. Yeah, they're nice trailers. Look at this. Yeah. We got a fireplace. Yeah. This is amazing. Tell us what you got. TV, you got your oh. stove, just like a conventional stove at your house. <laughs> Look at that. That is so fun. Actually, let me go make sure the propane's on. Okay. Hold on a second. Gotcha. Oh my gosh, look at Hats, we got hats, we got, oh my, you have vermoli. <laughs> Isn't that cute? <laughs> old lives matter, call me old fashioned. <gasps> oh my gosh, you guys. Look at the size all of right. this refrigerator. I forget all the, oh my God, I got waters in there. Look at that. That is a 12 volt refrigerator. It's amazing. 16 cubic inch, it's huge. That is huge. That is. Man, that door closes with a vengeance, doesn't it? With that yes, I, mean, I just I shut it myself pretty good. Okay. It just takes a sec for the Was propane. it on? The propane? No. Oh, no, it wasn't I had it off. Okay. Yeah. All right. Just show all your burners work. 
Oh, God, it's probably lit down here. Yeah, right? by now, huh? Um, oh, we gotta like cut the mine. things out. Yeah. I'll cut those out of there before you guys take it. We don't want to bake them? Yeah. Oh, yeah, pack it's on. That's good. I see. I think I see it burn. You see a little flame? Yeah. Oh, there is. Okay, there it is. And then, there we go. No more having to bend down here and light the, light the nice. pilot. There it goes. There we go. It takes a minute for the, the propane to come down. Yeah. Microwave. So you can set your clock on it, whatever. Yeah. So, um, it's like a full size residential microwave. Yeah. That's huge. I yeah. love that one over there too. Yeah. But everything is big, 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 big. They have soft closed cabinets. Look at that. <laughs> Oh, wow. That's yeah, great. I can't slam cameras I'm just looking around. at these mm -hmm. LED lights. They've oh, really come gosh. up yeah. with the lights. Those are really nice. They have recessed lights now. Yep. They don't have those little silly puck lights like they used to. Yeah, they're all yeah. like can lights. So they have the underneath uh, lights here. Accent and the, lighting. Those yeah. are awesome. Yeah. Oh, show them the... Oh, the pantry? The pantry. And, and, and are you going to be able to, maybe Christy, or you can explain the um, travel fi? Is that something, the travel fi that it comes it's, with? It's a Wi-Fi type deal. Um, okay, I think you have to have an account. You set up your own account deal. Okay, yeah. okay. Well, That's we'll awesome. So did you see it has it? all the literature with it. Did you see how it just kind of turned on and on yeah. its own? And look, tire link. Yep, yep. tire link. So it's already that's included. already included. It's yep. already on there. Um, kit contains display. Oh! So you could put it in the in the truck, yeah, huh? Yep. That's awesome. I usually have it on my phone, but I that's love great. that pantry. I Look at this for Molly. Molly. <laughs> yeah, they just started doing those. What is what, oh, what, what is what is this thing? That's your Max Air. Um, we don't mount them; they come unmounted in case you want to put it in a specific place. Okay. Yourself. Okay. And that's for your Max fan right there. Oh, nice. Yeah. Wow. It's got an automatic rain oh, sensor on it. Oh, I love it. Okay, so that you that allows you power. To, It'll come on. That allows you to. to do it while it's raining, right? Is that what yes. It is? Yeah. This is odd. There it oh, goes. Oh, there it goes. Look at that. Once it opens up, it'll turn on. Wow. Come on in. Hi, Hi Christy. Like, what's up here in here? Hi, how are you? Hey, guys? how are you? Cool. Good. Good to we see you. We didn't want to look Hi. at this until you were here, but You're we, so under, sweet. we understand. No, welcome, Hi, Hi. How You are guys you? are so cute. I'm good. Oh, I'm How's good. Going? Good. Hi. Do you want to introduce Welcome. her? <laughs> this is our girl. All right. Hey. So this is our girl. This is Christy. She's the one that um, manipulated this whole thing. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> this is awesome. Worked her tail she off. worked yeah. her tail yeah. off. Yeah. Did a great job. Thank and, you. And just thank you so much for of all course. you've done. This is yeah. incredible. So I know it's a it's a new home, so away from home. So I always think it's awesome to make sure it's right. <laughs> Make sure that it's the right colors, you know, give people updates, so. I love all the little welcome gifts yes! and stuff. It's so cute. Yeah, and I saw so this, I was cute. like, oh, this is a fun little, like, That's so fun. tie-in for you guys. It's so fun. Sure. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yep, yep, yep. So it's the first look. So all we've seen look. so far is this little deal. Yeah, here, look at so. the, the fans at Max Air. Max Air, Max yeah. Air right now. They say the influence is the step between the reflection and the solitude. Mm -hmm. This is a winner. People are gonna love this rig. Mm -hmm. They were like, oh yeah. I'm gonna tell yeah. you this because this is what they were waiting for. Because the quality in here to me, some of it looks better than the solitude. Yeah, yeah, so, agreed. I believe they have their own line of interior colors from sure. the solitude, and yes. this is replacing the S class. I was researching right. that. Um, but I do, I love the 101 inch wide body. I mean it just has a lot to offer. A huge difference from the reflection to the to this for sure. That window. Oh. alone the two big windows yes. I and mean, those are solitude windows the, oh, you know absolutely. what I mean I, I, I think the reflection has the smaller one there and then has the big one here and it always looked a little ununiform I'm a very symmetrical person yes. where that drove me bonkers and so to have that big all this window you know all these windows just all open to that and they window. also recess the the uh, Balances or the, the ba window boxes? The yeah. boxes, so yeah. they're so much smaller, so you actually yeah. see more windows. So yeah, just that's right. Nicer. We haven't been that way yet, so. Oh, yeah, yeah well, come on in, you guys. Yeah, we'll check awesome. her out. Um, as we go up here, and I love this big window here. This is more than oh. well. Isn't this this is a big, big window I'd here. I'd like to be able to look out and you can see. Yeah, your camp out there. You can see, you know, if you're by the see. river, you can look out. I like how it doesn't have a screen here, so you can see. I can pass through. Did these slide open? Do you know? Yeah, I'm not. Oh, sure. they do? Yeah. I'll get all three. I was just wondering if I could still pass the, the 
you know, the oh, uh, size spices oh, out oh, to oh. you. Uh, uh, that's, <laughs> a, that's, a, that's a long drop for the ha for the hamburger. <laughs> hey, there you go. Put a little rope in there. And look at <laughs> big old JR <laughs> Motor sign. Yeah. Oh. Well, come on in here, you guys. This actually has wow. that big windshield up that there for you. That is See, amazing. See, that's, that's, that, that's the ticket right there. So, this is a ticket, folks. The queen. All right, so. Yes, I can walk. Uh, look at all this space. People are going king, queen. So this is what we found out. The king actually goes off to the side here and believe it or not we actually saw one you cannot close the door without lifting up the mattress in the king so i want you guys to remember that this allows you to be able to make your bed when you come you can mm -hmm. go fully around which the king is is a, is a nice thing for us but we this is just things that we want to share with you so you know when you start looking and what you can experience some of you guys just need a king i get it's it it's a personal preference it's a per right? personal yeah. preference one of my other favorite that. things is this is on like a little it has a little track there oh so it won't gosh, hang it in does. your face and then these are just little like push buttons right here. Oh, I believe. Yeah, they're nice. touch okay. little readers at night and or whatever. It still has the LED, like a little strip lighting up there. We haven't forgotten about Chris, though. Wait, no, Chris is back here with me. Yep. Chris. I'm good. Jump in anytime, Chris, so you no, don't have anything to say. Yeah, you what got kind of mattress did it come with? <laughs> you know, that's curious. a good question. Let's see. Curious. What does it come with? Oh, I'm gonna watch it. Oh, foam. It's it is mattress. 60 by foam, 80. Foam mat. It's memory foam. It gonna, is memory foam. Oh, it is, yeah. I'm and it is a standard size, like an actual yeah. house size mattress. Like I'm gonna watch you throw it out of here. <laughs> yeah. Goodbye, nectar. We'll see. I don't know. This came back as a good. Well, lift up the bed. See what the storage oh, looks like underneath, underneath there. Underneath here. Here's your cord. Wow. There you go. I oh. feel like those opened so much easier than our old one. Oh, yeah. yeah. It was just, I mean, it was heavy. Look at all that storage under there. That's great. Oh, my gosh. It goes all the way back. I had back. no idea. Yeah. It goes all the way back there. So the things wow. that you, you never need. Wow. So. That's amazing. That, like, water and stuff like that could go there, right? Because. Oh That's my great. gosh. This Look at all your fun. closet space. Oh, this is all Rhonda's closet space. No, <laughs> no, no. I don't have much. Look at that. It's like, and they have the magnetic latches. Definitely too. doubled, if not quadrupled, our space for, for clothes. So this is all part of the slide, even in the bathroom. That's yes, part of the slide. Yes, it's all slide. Yeah. Yep. Okay. It's good yeah. too, because even when this is closed up, you can still get to your bathroom. You can still get to your bedroom. Yes. If everything's That's still nice. functional when it's closed. That's a good point. That's how they. Excellent. So okay, so. So the, the whole, slide is the from there comes yeah. in. to there. Okay. This whole thing will come I see in. how they've done and this with the barn door and yeah. stuff it's like that. It's only going to come into like the edge, I imagine. Yeah, just bit by an early touch. Yeah. Look yeah. <laughs> the shower. Oh my gosh. Yep, you've got your ceramic toilet here, yeah. and then you've got, this is a beautiful shower. I love oh. this one. One thing I like about this shower in particular is obviously it's got the, um, the nice little shower head up here, oh. but down here it's all one piece. So you don't have a lip down here where water could possibly get into your seams from underneath. So all one piece um, so shower. shower, yeah, yeah. super nice. And, and it steps down too, right? Yeah, yeah. Yep. So you step, yep. Mm -hmm. So if you had a little baby or something like that, you could do a tiny little thing or wash your dog. Wash your dog, yeah. yeah, perfect. Yeah, um, I will oh say one gosh. thing I do really enjoy about this one too is the depth of the counter. Yeah, you some nice. Uh, you could do some baskets back there. It's just got a lot of space there right. for you. And then these are nice to deep medicine wow. cabinet. Wow, yeah. a lot deeper than normal. See, they finally put in sinks that you can oh, actually light too. wash in there. That's, that's kind of nice, too. This is a... Um, that's your Insta-Hot. Insta-Hot. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. And this is Come a... Come on in. Yeah, it's a Furion, wow. which is good stuff. Furion's, like, top of the line now. Ah, uh, he's going to show down. you the controls. There you go. This is a Compass Connect. You can connect to Wi-Fi, YC monitor on your phone. Okay. Everything's push-button. Okay. Water pump. When you're dry camping, right. you want to use your water pump. When you're in a park, you hooked up to the water, you don't have to worry about using your pump. It's um, it's um, prep for a generator if you ever decide to put a generator in it. Porch light, awning light, um, tank heater if you ever need it. Here's all your controls for your two awnings outside. Here's your three slide controls. Perfect. You just press it once to wake it up. Press it again, you'll see your cool start blinking. You can switch it to electric heat, electric heat or gas heat. Or you can go to just uh, cool hot to where it'll switch in between from, from heater to, to air conditioning. Oh. So it actually has a heat pump in it? Yeah, yeah, there, it does. The center one will always have a heat pump. Uh, uh, I don't think we want the heater on right now. Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so we just press it again. There we go. We'll switch it back. Let's push go off. Just hit off. Then it'll ask you about your fan. Turn your fan on. Okay. So like the old units used to be, you have to run everything on auto on this. Right? I would I would always use your auto. There is an auto setting on here. Mm -hmm. When you're running your air conditioner, you want to use auto. So say we go cool. See it's on auto right there. You got mm -hmm. auto high and low. There's low. Yeah. So and then it has regular where you just have it on high, which I would never recommend doing that. I right. um, always like to run them on low and uh, turn it down low. And that is just for this air conditioning unit and the one this in there. controls. There's two or three on here. There's two. There's okay, two. so it just controls. This one controls right here. Okay. Your bedroom one should be on your wall. Right oh, it has one in the okay. bedroom too. All right, so it has. Yeah, here's your bedroom. All right, perfect. And let me tell you, these suckers get cold. They they work very well. Blast you out. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, cool. There's. That's one. great. All right, guys. So this is the new sink from Grand Design. I absolutely love this. It's a smart sink. So a few fun features here. I was um, really looking at this. You could actually chop your veggies up and scoop them off into this little colander. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay. Yeah, that's your so, blend valve. And then that's is, your drain. This is my drain. Okay. Yeah. And then this, I saw this had a few different like. No, just just two here. different ones. Two different, yeah, there we go. That one. This is they call this for the really dirty dishes. They were saying. And mm. then how do I get this one on? Is it? No, this is just this called? just stops your. No, that's the other side. Okay. Then the other side will be your rinse. There we go. There we go. Oh, that's what it is. Like yeah. Vegetables. Yeah. You know. What? It's so amazing. This is a cup wash. Oh yeah, your cup oh, wash. Put your cup on it and press it. Oh, How cool! I love oh, it. Oh, you guys, this is so fun. Look at that. Nice. Turn it. Uh, yeah, you got the right way. Red back there. Perfect. We had this little baby battery in there, so we're putting two 27s in there, and so. Um, just, nice. you know how we, we've always done the lead acid, so we'll do this for a little bit, and then uh, maybe later on we'll go to lithium. They've got some huge 300 watt solar panels up there, really nice. Okay, we're gonna go in the service center and take a peek. Okay guys, yeah, uh, I welcome to JR Motors. Just wanna introduce you to our new facility. We're about a year old now, um, but one of the neat things about this company is we've been around for about six years um, on the same property um, out here, but I will mention this is actually a 30, uh, it is 30,000 square, 30, foot. square foot. Um, just shy of that for this hole between sales, service, and the parts center. Um, but this does hold about 20 items inside. So one thing I love about it is, uh, this is Travis, he's our, actually one of our lead service managers here, um, and he does a phenomenal job. So when you call in, he's probably the one that picks up the phone or makes sure that it gets done right. So remember that, ask for Travis. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Um, do you have anything you want to share with us? No, other than just wander real quick and take a peek. Yeah, let's show, show what we I, got. I do mention that we're the one of the only people in Lost, or uh, I'm sorry, Lake Havasu that does do, um, Nice air, like temperature controlled, like for the ACs and things like that for, for the for technicians. The tech's working. That's a, that was a huge so, advantage to the building was being able to close the doors in the summer, and it certainly all the all the employees are certainly happy. And I always say a happy tech, they're going to do a good job. They're not going to be rushed. You know, some of these places there's no air conditioning, so it's hot. You know, they're like, let's get it done. So that's one thing I do find the quality and the you know we keep it clean. So yeah, come on guys, we'll give you. So a I got a question for you real quick, yeah. Christy. So service is the backbone of these places. Absolutely. So how far behind are you guys? And I know that's a horror story for a lot of folks, but we usually keep it about a week, week and a half out. Are you serious? Right now, um, first of May, right now, but that's kind of typical for this time of year. A lot of the snowbirds are heading out, so right. they've filled up April pretty quick. Plus we're still trying to get the Okay, so Travis, if, if, if they call you during the summer, hey, I need this done, you're saying you can get them in and out in a week? Usually, yes. Did you hear that? In and out in a week. Which place do you know that does that, Does not that you're not there for like three months? And typically, if you know it's going to be a part that we need to order, you'll get the appointment set, we'll get the part in, and then we'll have them bring the RV that's not sitting here for three months, like on site. So they'll make the appointment to Perfect. come back in. So you can I use your rig. I have a horror story because I had that. I I'm gonna jump inside. Oh, you, go you gotta go to lunch. Thank you, Not Travis. I, I have a horror story because it, we went to a place in Vegas and and they we, they were gonna replace the counter. Oh, the counter is in. It took us three months before yes. we got that back. Yeah. That was in our Jayco. Yeah. Three months. That is 
huge. Yeah. Huge. And maybe think of all the memories and you know camping trips you miss out on because mm -hmm. and all the plans maybe you had you know we don't plan for things to break down so if you have you know camping reservations things like that you got to cancel them and stuff so come on I'll show you guys around real quick here okay just watch your step this is yeah. gonna be kind of our RV area on this side we've got garage doors on both sides that are they go up and then back here we've got our boat section um we carry a variety of different brands atc valor the grand designs i've never heard of atc before yeah they're all of them toy hauler companies so wow. um, they hold they hold a lot of cargo like up to eight thousand pounds wow. inside this is working on our battery box um we only had one battery we elected to go to a two bigger battery so he's working on that real quick right here and now and he's getting it done crazy he's making the dream happen yeah. <laughs> so. But yeah, back here we buy, and um, this is our, actually our rental department back here. So if this is where they oh, um, keep yeah. the rental trailers, we have about 38, I believe, trailers in town um, where we drop them off and pick them up. If people want to bring their boat from California and they don't want to um, bring the trailer at the same time, they can rent these out too. So wow. and that's something, it's a full other spectrum of us um, in this 30,000 yeah. square foot. Did building. you guys hear that? You can rent a trailer from them and do you guys set it up? Or yep, do they have, they have their reservation? Yep, they call in, they make a reservation okay. at their own park within about an hour area of this area. An hour. Um, and then we will drop it off and pick it up. Fantastic. We do the cleaning, everything. So when you get there, the air conditioner's on, the fridge is wow. cold, all that. So oh my pretty gosh, cool. That's so pretty yeah, call in if you have questions. And then we got uh, all services, all services. Yep. Then we got this is actually Ooh. our head technician Dion up here for the boat, and then uh, this is actually my general manager Bubba over here. Hey Bubba. Hi hey, Bubba. Hey, guys. Nice to meet How you. are you? Hi. I need to meet you. <laughs> yeah, I'm Stan Wyatt. Nice Rachel. to meet you. Yeah. Picking up the influence <laughs> today. Yeah. This is my yeah. wife Rhonda. Nice. Hi. Nice to meet, nice you. To meet you. Beautiful view back here. Yes, you do. Nice cross breeze. And then when you come in, you can always pull in the front there and you can oh, wow. drop your RVs off or over here, whichever is best for you. You got see the art restrooms over here, drinking fountains. This place is beautiful. Thank you. Stop on by. If you guys haven't been by, just check it out. It's a whole new experience for sure here. So, all right guys. Well, thank you so much for visiting us here at JR today and we look forward to meeting you when you come by. Everything. Everything. Yeah. Love it. This is Jim signing his life away. <laughs> Closing it up. And we just brought in slide number one. So different. Okay, so slide number two. Oh boy. So you, they're called tilt out. Look at that. Crazy. We'll have to go back and you want to stop for a second? Mm -hmm. Did I realize your two lights on each side of your couch are on? Oh, are they like push yeah, button ones? Yeah, you have to turn those on on each one. So on the Schwinterek, they always said, don't stop once you start rolling. Yeah, no, yeah. these ones you can't. You can't, yeah, okay, yeah. all right. So much to learn. Yeah, if it was Schwinterek, I would have just had you bring it all the way in. And, and back out, okay. Yeah. Continuing on. This was number two, two yeah. in. It's really good to see the access that we have like when we're on the road like we can get okay. it would probably be tight for you to go through there yeah like i'm just this curious area, you'll be able to be still. okay it's kind of cool because like if we stop at least we can get something out of the fridge we could squeeze yeah. over here and have a bite yeah. to eat or yeah. just sit at the table all right and in three yep all clear go ahead you're welcome Slides are in. When you pull it out, there's no locking it out. It just it just stands Pops out on its out. own. Okay. A lot of people would say try and put the pin in and it don't work like that. It's just to hold it so in. So where do you get where do we put the pin just to keep it safe? You just from, put oh it you back put it right back here. in there. Yeah, yeah. Got it. That's all, right. all that is. And then you close it and put yep. the pin in there to and lock it right while we travel. Yep. They're up. really light, huh? Yeah, always make sure your doors open. Yeah, all the way got so it. So this don't catch it and mess yeah, it up. Yeah, that was I always just put them up slowly. Okay. And that's it. Love it. If you ever get to a place where the ground's higher or lower next to your trailer, you can always adjust your legs right here. Okay. They adjust out pretty far, too. It's fantastic. And that's and it. Lock it up and it. off that's we go. It.
it's our first hookup, don't judge. Our first fifth wheel hookup, don't judge. <laughs> Too harshly. <laughs> Making sure it didn't hit. Everything is so new again. Oh my gosh, this is crazy. Just feels a little scary. It just looks weird. Holy, holy, the geezers. 